Hi there. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to take us for a walk around this rather lovely red uh, 40 kilowatt uh, Renault Zoe. Um, nice car this one, I think particularly because of the red colour. It's in great condition, but um, to be fair we don't see many of these red ones and it is a rather nice red. Um, stats on the car, it's done well, uh, 25,700 miles, so it's low miles. Um, next MOT is not due until the end of July next year. Uh, next MO, next service, sorry, isn't due until uh, October next year. Uh, it's all good to go, nothing to worry about for quite a while, and like I say, the condition on this car is excellent. Obviously, 40 kilowatt Zoe, so the party trick is its range. You're looking about 160 odd miles of range, quite comfortably. And condition wise, it's great. As I go round, I will point out any marks. Um, see, there's a few little uh, watermarks on there. The, the, the fork got a bit of a clean yesterday in the rain. and. Uh, a few little chips here. There's a couple of tiny little chips down the door edge. Very small though. Um, alloys are okay on this side. There's a little bit of a mark there. I think it's just something that's been sort of previously touched up. Um, isn't really particularly noticeable. And fair above it, there's a little bit of a scratch as well. Um, Minor though, got to be very very close to see it. Um, see the boot and the bumper are fine. Excuse the little spots. Uh, watermarks on there, that whole is also okay. As is that one. I'm sure there's the odd stone chip somewhere on the front, on the bumper or the bonnet, although I must admit nothing immediately stands out. There is there's a couple of little, little stone chips there, but nothing major. I say overall, overall this is a really tidy car. There's nothing really to, to be in any way off-putting condition-wise. Uh, same is true of the interior. It's all very nice, they've all got the same interior. Um, uh, the, the surround of the media console is is very prone to sort of peeling and chipping and cracking, uh, but this one's absolutely fine, so that's really good. Um, as an upgrade, this car's also got a reversing camera uh, as well as rear sensors, so that's a really good, desirable thing to have, and also not particularly common. Uh, three seats in the rear, good condition again. Like I say, there's nothing wrong with that interior at all. That's like a new car. Just pop open the boot and poke our head in there. Surprisingly big boot on these Zoe's. And this one's in really nice nick. And obviously it's just a boot, but um, you'd normally expect to see some marks on the uh, inside of the, the boot sill. But there's barely a mark there. All very nice. And in there we'll be putting a three pin charging lead as well. So you'll, you'll have this car with a lead you can plug into any normal main socket and charge from that. So you don't necessarily even need to get a charge point installed. Yeah, and there you have it. Uh, if you're looking for, well, if you're looking for a, a, a 40 kilowatt Zoe with some character, um, that's this car here. The, the red colour makes it a little bit more exclusive, and I think looks very attractive. Also got the reversing camera. That's a really big plus, and it's in great condition. Um, and of course, the Renault Zoe is a great value car for the range that it performs. Um, and it's here on the forecourt, ready for a test drive reviewing. Alternatively, we can deliver this car straight to your home. Uh, but please be sure to also check out our other Renault Zoe content on our YouTube channel uh, and hopefully we can help you decide whether the Renault Zoe is the right car for you. Um, thank you very much for watching and hopefully we'll speak to you soon.